the first Toyotas we received was 1956. They brought in 200 Toyo pets. And my father, uh, he was contacted by the, the Toyota people and asked if he could process them. And we removed this very black, thick cosmoline off the bumpers. And uh, after a few months of testing them and trying to sell them, they decided the car wasn't ready for the U.S. market, and they shipped most of them back to Japan. But they contacted us again in the early 60s when they, finally, when they came in with the Corolla car. We weren't too uh, uh, sure that this car would make it. In fact, the European and the U.S. manufacturers told us that these cars will never succeed. And yet we opened up in San Pedro at Perth 231, where Evergreen is located now. And in that location, there were two two-story sheds with a ramp in between that uh, we managed to unload the cars in the valley, park them across the street anywhere we could as business succeeded and we took on new accounts. We had a wash rack upstairs in the building on one side and we had a body shop on the other side. And the cars in those days were coming in mixed on brake bulk ships and the first early roll on roll off, combination car carriers, false decks, lots of damage, so lots of work to be done on the cars. As you know, and we all know now, we were just at the tip of the iceberg, and this became a very successful venture for both the Port of Los Angeles and ourselves.